Hello and welcome to the campus of the University of Evansville. I'm Tom Kuzi, president of the university. This is our first podcast of 2012. We hope you had an enjoyable holiday season. Our spring semester is now underway here at the University of Evansville, although you'll notice behind me we had a little bit of snow last night. The campus is really lovely in its blanket of white. Congratulations to the 76 students who earned degrees at our annual winter commencement ceremony on December the 14th. This was the first class of graduates to participate in a new UE tradition, the gift of blank keys, actual keys that can be cut to be used by students. Those keys came from the UE Alumni Association. The keys symbolize the world of opportunities available to UE graduates. The keys are the keys to their future. Thanks so much to the Alumni Association for sponsoring that new tradition. Also, this was the first graduating class to benefit from something we call UE Connect, which is a new mentoring initiative that connects current students and recent graduates to UE alumni, parents, and friends. We often say that graduation isn't the end of a student's relationship with UE. It is, in fact, just the beginning of a new chapter. We're very excited about this program, which will engage our alumni and help our new graduates to succeed. UE Connect recently earned international recognition from CASE, which is the Council of Advancement and Support for Education, which featured the UE Connect initiative as the top story in its monthly e-newsletter for December 2011. If you'd like to get involved with UE Connect, please visit evansville.edu slash ueconnect to learn more. Each January, one of the first major events of the spring semester is the celebration of Martin Luther King Jr. Day. The goal of the day's activities is to honor Dr. King's life and legacy while encouraging participants to consider the role of social justice in 2012 and in their own lives. One highlight of this event is a reenactment of the 1963 Civil Rights March on Washington, D.C., where Dr. King delivered his famous I Have a Dream speech. We were pleased also to welcome Rabion Charles back to campus as the featured speaker in the William G. and Rose M. Mays Martin Luther King Jr. Lectureship. She previously was the Director of Diversity Initiatives here at UE and now serves as an Assistant Vice President at the University of Texas at Austin. Also this month at UE, we celebrate the one-year anniversary of ACE Care. ACE Care is a program I've mentioned in an earlier podcast. It was started by a group of UE doctoral students to provide pro bono physical therapy services to homeless and uninsured residents of the Evansville area. This program gives students an opportunity to put their skills into action while supervised by faculty members and local physical therapists. It also demonstrates their altruism and commitment to filling a critical need in the community. In ACE Care's first year, UE students logged more than 450 volunteer hours and served 70 patients. We're very proud of that program. Thanks for joining us for another edition of our podcast from the University of Evansville. Please provide feedback on these podcasts to president at evansville.edu. Thanks so much.